crashed. It crashed, Epic Game Store. Why did it crash? Okay, one. It's only happened once, so be fair. Now, uh, went through the spiel before. Let me see if I can say it again without forgetting all the finer points, key points, whatever. When this came out, or when this was announced, the Samurai Shodown Collector's Collection, whatever, I formulated a plan, a means to get myself good for playing the most recent Samurai Showdown game online. I wanted to try and get myself up to the point where I can get on there with the big boys. Hang. Big boys, big girls, whoever. Hang for a minute. So I thought maybe what I'll do is, you know, pump some YouTube content out in the process is work my way through the old games, try and get good across the board. We'll see how well this turns out. Hopefully about as well as uh, Al Maru cutting through them lanterns in that tree. go with my boy from back in the day. Actually, when I was testing, I actually conducted some business with Jubei. So let's give him a shot. Jubei! Scourge of the Ainu, prepare to death. Uh, that's awfully intense for Nakamuru. Nakamuru? Nakamuru, yeah. Then again, this is the first game. Because she's supposed to be like all... Kind and pure and all that stuff. There. Christ. Shibei Yagyu. He's based on an actual historical figure. A lot of gaps in his history that makes uh, people have a lot of fun writing about him. You know, there's just space to fill with crazy shit. Uh, people tend to put more into... Uh, what was the name of the guy that Haomaru was based on? Um... Mimoto Musashi. The Jubei gets a lot of uh, fiction written about him, too. So. And I think the name of the author is Futaro Yamato, the guy who wrote uh, Mikai Tensho, that this uh, game takes a lot of inspiration from. Features. Oh my god, I murdered her! Anyway, um, don't laugh about that, Jubei, you sick bastard. That bear is getting down! <laughs> Straight getting it. Anyway. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, just there's a couple of characters in here who are based on historical figures. Uh, Roy Ponzo, I think, as well. The ninja? You'll see him later. Uh, and the boss of this game, also. Based on historical figures. Uh, if you want a neat uh, depiction of the story, Makai Tensho, well, the 80s film featuring, I can't remember the name of the guy who played, uh, I think it was also Hitori Hanzo in um, Kill Bill, Sonny Shiba, that's it, the Sonny Shiba Samurai Resurrection film is a loose adaption of Makai Tensho. Um, it's really good. There's also a manga, I think literally, called Makai Tensho. That's a, I think, a more accurate... I don't know, I haven't read Makai Tensho properly. To say for certain how accurate it is. Um, but, uh... You are awfully agile for a big fat man. I'm trying to talk to the audience here. 
Help me out. Get it. Gotcha. And there's another one. Another one bites the dust. Um, what was I saying? Oh, Makai Tensho. Yeah, literal manga called Makai Tensho. Don't know if it's been released in the States, but you should be able to find fan translations of it. Pretty good. Um... Same author that did Makai Tensho also did Code of Ninja Scrolls, which is the story Basilisk is an adaption of. Really, there's a bunch of stuff by this uh, author from back in the day called Futaro. Is it Yutaro Yamada? Futaro Yamada? I can't remember. But uh, there's a lot of pretty good stories based on his novels. The novels themselves. They've got some timey stuff in them. Kind of like the Vampire Hunter D novels where they get like weirdly freaky. So the adaptions tend to be a bit more palatable. Ow! I counted my upper with my upper. There. Uh, judo throw. And he got the chicken. Oh, good. Because you needed that. You needed that. You were having such a hard time. And you needed that. Man, I'm landing his throws left and right, though. Oh, well. Chips. He got chicken and chips. That ain't fair. Quit hoarding food, buddy. Let me have some. Ow. Oh, my God. My life did that take. Well, I mean, he does lose a sword after that. Ow. Damn it! He beat me barehanded! Oh. Attack. Okay, okay. I have another move. I have another move. Okay. I got another move. Another move I've been s neglecting. I almost said spam it, because that's what I'm about to do. Let's see if I can spam it. Ow. Oh, you. Ah, jumper cables, you dingus. Oh, the butt. The butt. I don't want the butt. You're not a pretty lady. I don't want the butt from you. God, okay. I need to make peace with this round not being mine. Whoa, bombs! Bombs everywhere! That's not fair at all! Have some chips. They're good for you. <laughs> Damn, just laughing right in his face. Yeah, them guys in the background with the bombs, they were getting a little, a little happy, a little pleased with themselves. Fuck out of here. Shit. Ah, uh. oh, what? Poke. How do you like that? How do you like that, Poke? Poke. Ow, ow. Damn it. The delay on that. You really gotta read it. 
Ow. Oh, God. Ran right into it. No. Ah, I was going to try and... Ha 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 I still got you. Sorry about peaking the volume on that. I apologize. Let me just go ahead and move this back a little bit. A little bit. Hopefully that's better. Damn. She bet you dirty. Oh no. <laughs> After 10,000 years, I'm free! It's time to conquer Earth! Yes. S U C C E S S. Fail success. Tokugawa, you filth! I stabbed thee! So, in the Makai Tensho, Shira's weapon was a whip made from the hair of women who were killed. During the, um, oh yeah, during the, in quotes, not in quotes, it's just the historical event. So the massacre. The massacre of Amakusa. Ow! Oh, ninja shit! Ninja shit! Oh yeah, uh, Tori Hanzo, I think, is another one based on a historical figure. Ah! Oh, ah, oh, ninja shit! Oh god, oh god, he's everywhere! Oh, that was brutal! Everyone likes laughing at each other. See you, see you, see you, see you. Samurai shit, motherfucker. Poke. 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 Ow. Big slice. Big slice. Nope. Yes! Yes! Ah. Yeah, okay, so I don't know if I've said it already, or if I said it in one of the failed attempts, recording attempts, the Make Fodder. The most important attack in Samurai Showdown, and I learned this from watching someone else play it, is not any one special move, it's not a hyper attack, it is your heavy slash. That is where the big meaty damage, more than any special move, more than anything else as such, the primary... Strategy. Is to land that. Though, you know, you can do some work with all the other stuff. That's like the big meaty hit. The reason why that second round I did did so well is because I was nailing that heavy attack over and over again. That heavy slash. That big slice. Big slice is where you do your business. You do your serious business. That's your big money. But I think the only thing bigger than the big slice per se is landing the big slice as a counterattack. I don't know if full-on counterattack damage in here is a thing. It probably is, and that's probably why round two went so fast. So yeah, counterattacks, big slice, big slice counterattack will fucking eat the life. Dick. Ow. He input red. That thing was too convenient, too perfect. Ow. Ow. Ugh. God. God worked. Damn it, damn it. Stop, 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 stop. Okay. Ow. 
Ow. Ow. Fucking Ryu. Oh, God. Oh, God. Nope. Got that ass blown up. Oof. Omae wa mo shinderu. Apparently. I'ma do it. I'ma do it. Damn, and this is only level two. <laughs> to die is not shameful, but better you than me. <laughs> they would say such silly shit in this game. I doing throwing a projectile at that range? Ah, oh, that's me. That's on me. It's on me. It's on me for something. God damn it. No, no, no. Let me have it. Let me have it. I need it. I need it way more than you. I need help. In a lot of ways. son or something. Or son got killed or something. To die is not shameful, but better you than me. Damn it. Damn it! Oh! Oof. He's nailing me with those heavy slashes. Not nice. rather than better. Too close. That's bullshit. You know it. Anyway. Actually, this looks... At least I'm thinking about the uh, movie, the Kai Tensho. There's a scene in there that looks at this level. Yeah. 
Yay, it landed. Oh, and he had to counter it. Oh, oh, oh good. Because... Ugh. I was sitting there feeling good about myself for half a second. Ugh. hitbox or some shit? What the... I don't understand. Okay. Come on, Jubei. We gotta get our shit together here. We can do this. If we just try. We can do anything by working together. first and I took that heavy slash and I got all impatient damn it damn it Damn it. Ugh. It's damn it, the musical. Damn, we're getting worked this hard on level two. Uh Alright, let's take one more crack at this before I take a break. Contemplate the nature of my existence as both a game player. Content creator and a human being. Under the nature of my life and the choices I made to bring me to this point. Ugh. 
doing better earlier. It's like the more I play him, the worse I do. Ah! See that right there, I fucking bump him. And that one little bit hits, but for some reason the uppercut doesn't win. Oh. Oh. Right, let's try maybe changing characters. I know I said that would be the last one, but. Well, when I was playing before with Galford, this is where I got screwed up too. Maybe Hanzo's just busted. No, you can't have your sword. You can't have your sword. You can't have it. You can't have it. No. No, I need you to not have it. I need this. I need all the help I can get. That's one. That's one. That's one. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, spirits. The earth or whatever. Ow! Got him! Ah! Got him! Oh. my luck, Galford is the most busted character in the game. And I'm only getting by for that reason, but whatever. Justice triumphs. Huh? The fuck? Such hate. Chill. Whoa. Ambrosia. Power of this dark guy. Bean brain. Crazy funster. Whoa. That got weird. I don't think I remember that from the Genesis game. I don't know if that was in there. It's weird. Galford identified the weird ass thing as Ambrosia, even though it introduced itself as Shiro Hamakuza. Whatever. Point is, is we're going to call it here for part one. So, thank you as always for watching. Have a good day.